Hello, and welcome to edition three of Icy Sundays. I've decided to try and tone it down a bit and be a bit more calm in videos because watching them back you realise just how annoying you are in real life. Anyway, hello, welcome. It's Sunday the 1st of October 2017 and we are of course seven days closer to Mesmerise 2018. Being that it is only 277 days until that glorious 5th of July that I am so much looking forward to. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the bad news. Get out of the way. Because, sadly, as you'll notice maybe, if you can see it, one of the lists isn't on the wall. That is the Skaters Will Miss next year. I found out about two more who will not, apparently, be coming back. That's quite sad. Um, so, we'll just write their names on. Firstly, Miss Alexandre Kubel. I do think you say it. I've been saying Kubel this whole time, but pretty sure it's Kubel. That's how I heard it pronounced on a YouTube video anyway. So yes, sadly, Alexandre Kubel will not be coming back. And also another skater, the Slovakian with that so cool name, Tara Rajek, if that's even how you say it. Yeah. That's kind of sad, isn't it, that now the list has grown by two, so we've now got, what? Yes, okay, I've still got the dress problems. Really need to take it to get those it fixed. I'll be doing that this week. It's on the to-do list, okay? Um, I don't really have much else to say. Uh, oh, I did hear through the actual Hot Eyes grapevine, well, and Usher told me, that apparently, apparently, the finale is going to be changed next year. I do know the pink one, what I'm used to for the last two years, Joy to the World, has been going for a while. Uh, pretty sure. Because you see like pictures of Olga, don't you, in that outfit from maybe far as far back as 2014. But I don't know how long it's been going, but I think it's been going quite a while. And I really like it, and I just hope that whatever the finale changes to, it still has the skaters coming up and giving you like a shaking your hand or high fiving at the end. I don't know. All you fans, people who've been watching the show for years and years, or no, maybe that never changes. I don't even know. But yeah, that's what I hope. Hey, guess what? Randomly. I got this little gift set thing from Sainsbury's the other day. It's a glitter ball, or a mirror ball. Is it a mirror ball, you call it? Isn't it cool? It's just got body spray in it. But, I like it. It reminds me of the one at the arena. And the one in Strictly Come Dancing. <laughs> anyway, getting back to the subject. I might call this a episode or edition of Icy Sundays. Let's get statistical. Because we're going to get statist statist statistical, okay? Who wants to know how many shows there are next year? I'm going to tell you. Yes, I have been on the website and literally counted all of the bookable shows. 104, which if I've worked out right is down three shows on the year, on this year. This year we had a hundred and, um, what? We had a hundred and seven bookable shows. And I worked that out as being one less than 2016. Um, meaning that it was 108. So 108 last year, 107 this year, 104 next year. I can understand it going down because, like, you know, attendances and stuff. Let's just hope Dancing on Ice does wonders for it. That's what I'm hoping. So yeah, um, your opening night's the 5th of July, obviously. You've got a lot of, you've got 7 p.m. show on there, and then Friday the 6th you've got 7 p.m. Bloody blah, blah. You've got your usual jump into the week afterwards, and 11.30 on Tuesday the 10th of July, and Thursday the 12th of July, 11.30. I think you can go and see those shows, but, um, yeah, I think you can go and see them, but, um, I don't know. I do like school performances. Anyway, yeah. Getting a bit, um, anyway. Right, okay, let's try and keep on track with this. Uh, 107 shows, I've worked it out as being 47 matinees and 57 evenings. Yes. So there's more evening shows, because basically the second week, in July, 
um, no, not the second week of it, the third week of it, basically from Monday the 16th of July to Saturday the 21st of July, they're all 7pm shows with no matinees. Don't know why that is, maybe something's going on in the arena at the, in the day. But apart from that, you pretty much have a usual run of 2.30pm matinees and 7pm evenings. Uh, yeah. How many hot ice days are we going to have? 57, yes. Every day that's a hot ice day has an evening show. Only 10 don't have matinees. And I do include the 11.30s uh, performances in, in the matinee days. There's 23 days in July, 27 in August, 7 in September. Um, and if we're working off the premise of this year, that this year, like, every at one is done on a Saturday and a Tuesday and a Thursday, and Act 2 always goes on a Monday and a Wednesday and a Friday, which I noticed did happen last year and happened this year, apart from the first Saturday where they did the Act 2, but I reckon it's because it's better. But I don't know. I don't know why that decision was taken. Uh, yeah, then I've worked out, basically, the matinees, you're going to have, what, 22 opportunities to see Act 2, if they're done on the same days, and you're going to have 25 opportunities to watch Act 1. Let's hope Act 1 is really buzzing next year. Oh, I know they're all both good, but you tend to have a preference, so my advice to you is, if you're going to see a matinee, uh, go and watch the full show first, and decide which, which half you prefer, and then you can know which matinees you want to go see. Yeah, do that. <laughs> um, so, you got seven Monday matinees, eight Tuesday matinees, eight Wednesday matinees, eight Thursday matinees, seven Friday matinees, and nine Saturday matinees next year. Nine Monday evenings, nine Tuesday evenings, nine Wednesday evenings, ten Thursday evenings, ten Friday evenings, ten Saturday evenings. Fifty-seven evenings, forty-seven days. Performances. Are you following this? Probably not. This gives us 2,350 minutes of matinee shows and 5,700 minutes of evening shows. Add it all together, that's 8,050 minutes next year of Mesmerise. Obviously not on the dot, because sometimes I'm sure they finish before the 50 minutes and whatnot, and sometimes they'll go over. But, in general, just keep into the standard 50 minutes matinee, 100 minutes evening. That's how many minutes of hot ice next year we're going to get. Hooray! I am so excited. It's going to be so good. So buzzing. Um, so yeah. I'll just start you off. Thursday the 5th of July, 7pm. Friday the 6th of July, 7pm. Saturday the 7th of July, 2.30pm, 7. That's your first Saturday matinee. Monday nights of July, 7pm. Tuesday the 10th of July, 11.37. Wednesday 11th of July, 2.37. Thursday 12th of July 11.37, Friday 13th of July 7pm, Saturday 14th of July 2.37, Monday the 16th of July through to the Saturday the 21st, as I said, are all 7pm. Then you go to Monday the 23rd of July 2.37, which starts you off on a usual run, as we all know, Monday through Saturday 2.37. Okay, so those are some statistics. If anyone was even bothered, you probably weren't. But uh, yeah. Okay, I'm guessing this wraps up this edition of Icy Sundays, where we prefer our ice hot.